They're going to be three wide right here. Spotter's got to be working hard. Well, oh. contact there between Bell and Cindric. Three wide from position. Oh. More contact made. You wonder if Larson knew they were three wide that entire time. <laughs> that was insane. Oh, here we go. Cindric's tired of getting slid. He did not let that happened that time. Saw it early in the race a couple times. That's for Denny, and it's going to bring her along El Amarola as Look well. Look at this Whoa, dive bomb. Chastain Whoa. almost gets in the back of Denny Hamlin. Gets the thing slowed up. I guarantee everybody saw that coming, Clint. <laughs> Ross isn't going to mess Watch around. This. Now the opportunity for Logano. Will he take it? Here he goes. Who said there wasn't going to be any passing? Wow. Four Somebody's going to have to give in this one. Bottom, four bottom. I agree with you. Christopher Bell, good idea. Lifted, got back down to the bottom, sorting it out. In on that, Logano behind him. Slamming Ooh. in the turn. Oh! oh. Three up Logano in heat sideways. More contact. Byron all the way to the bottom. Again, these are for stage points, people. This is just for stage points, but that's how critical it they are for these championship contenders. Look at Logano take that spot. I mean, he came from four cars back to make that move. And Oh, Larson has to lift, stuck in the middle, jammed up with a slower car on the outside. And look, look at, at the run. run Eric Jones has. Whoa, be careful, Eric. You get those big runs like that, those moments, and those moments are created by somebody having to lift out of the gas. Everybody kind of makes an evasive maneuver around that, and he had that momentum, but once he got down to the entrance of three, he was in trouble. Still in there, still there, no pressure behind you and him. Man, that car got loose. You heard him bail out of the gas and grab a handful of wheel. That was still down there on the really, apron. really close. Up Both of those drivers fighting for this position. They know how important that clean air is. Single pile behind them, but side by side for the lead. Oh, did you see the flames come out of Joey's pipes? He got tight, had to bail out of the gas. Still there a little further ahead. I mean, going for it right there. 18's got to be careful not to do the exact same thing that the five did to him. Don't drive that thing off in there. Get loose under him and spin this thing out. Still, even at the line. Joey's having trouble with a tight race car. I think the 18 might get him. Ooh. Oh, might get him if you just knock him out of the <laughs> car. Running this high line in three and four. The 99 needs to figure this out because Basically, Joe Logano ran it, and he showed it to Bubba Wallace, and now Bubba Wallace is running it, and he's battling for the lead here. That time through the corner, not quite up against the wall like he had been, so it cost him a little bit there, but I think that if this 99 doesn't go up there to take that line away, we'll have a new leader here shortly. Suarez dives back to the bottom, as does the 45. And so Bubba Wallace trying the low line to get by Daniel Suarez for the lead here. And now they're side by side. So Bubba Wallace, hey, has got to try to overdrive the corner a little bit. Drive into the corner deeper. Get in front of him. Now take whatever line you want. Good work. That's what you want to do when you catch somebody. You don't want to get hung up behind them. You need to make that pass quickly. Bubba talked about this car is the same one they ran in Kansas. He loves this car. Here it is showing that same speed. Race winning speed early here at Vegas. He takes the lead. He's up the racetrack there now. The 99 side drafting a little bit. Here comes the car. Suarez back to the bottom of the racetrack. Bubba's going to use the momentum now on this high side to maintain this lead off the corner. Here comes the 22 as well. Little side draft there. He's trying to get close enough to pull that side draft, slow the 99 down. He makes it happen. Takes the Christopher Bell back here still battling for the lead. And now Blaney with a nose in front of the 19, oh. but not enough room to oh. complete the pass. That was a slide job, just didn't work out. They Here. slowed him down both so much. Here comes Hamlin. And Hamlin fighting for the lead once again. Oh, Hamlin man. up the racetrack a little bit. He's going to take away the line from the 12 car, Blaney. Here comes Truex with the run to, his out, to the outside of his teammate. Great racing right here after this restart. Hamlin saw how different his car was back there in traffic. He wants this clean air. <laughs> wants to get this lead back. Yep. 
And Blaney thinks he has the better car of any of them. He just needs to get, get another chance to get up there and take the lead. Look at this slide job. Wow, he just drove so far into the corner. Here comes Trix, though, back on the inside. So two out the back, two wide. That's brought everybody behind them up into this mix. Side by side, Kyle Busch. And the 12 of Blaney is the two leaders. Still battle. Two teammates battling down the back straightaway. Almost contact. Rick Truex has loved the outside. He's having to learn how to drive his car down here on the bottom. Junior, you almost used the right word. You were going to say mess. <laughs> and you <laughs> threw out the word mech. It has definitely been a mess up here in front and still undecided as Truex Jr. fights on the inside, trying to hold on to the top spot. Denny Hamlin working the outside the perfectly. Three out the back again. Still in there to your left rear. Three out the back, no run, no run. These two stay side by side for the lead. And right behind them, ready to pounce is the 18 of Kyle Busch. Kyle's way high off the racetrack. Going to have a pretty good run here down the straightaway. Three out the back with no run. You in the 19 here. You see what Hamlin's doing. He's Three driving really deep in the corner to keep Truex from trying that slide job. As long as Hamlin carries that much speed in the corner, Truex can't overdrive the entry and try to slide up in front of him. Hamlin taking that option away from him. Slowly but surely, let's bring the 18 car into this. He's going higher and higher, trying to get clean air up the racetrack. Keep his car side. Going to slow each other down on this back straightaway. Big run from the five. He's going three wide. No, he's going to push his teammate. Bubba had to lift on the exit of turn two. He got tight. Oh, so close. <laughs> up the racetrack goes the 24 of Byron. Byron was going to bury it down the corner. And Bubba said, no, we're both going in there. What a race. Bubba hanging oh, on to the spot, but a little bit loose there. The 24 clears him. Logano got to the back bumper of Bubba Wallace. Sure did. Got him uncomfortable there for a minute. Now we're side by side with the Hendrick teammates. What does Bubba do? Bubba's going to stay behind the 24. I'm Larson. I'm looking in my mirror, and I'm just trying to give you a little bit of dirty air. I don't want you to get to my left rear quarter panel, though, and pull it back. I like it. it up. I moved down just a little bit, trying to take a little bit of that air away from you. Two laps to go. Here he comes again. Not clear. And the caution waves. Hey, don't think Kyle Larson wanted to see that either. Absolutely not. Stop, uh, 24. Still out there, clear up, clear up, clear up. 24 outside now, outside, just doing the 24. 11 half back now. That's Kyle Larson spotter. The wind is giving him a good push down that back straightaway. He's giving the 14 a big push, too, to the lead, as a matter of fact. But now he shoots to the bottom across the apron. You need to hear clear up. That's what the five cars listening for right here, and he's going to hear it. Three wide for third. You see Denny's car there come off the apron and uh, hit that bump we were talking about all day yesterday and saw some dust fly out of the bump. Looks like he's still uh, hitting that hole pretty hard down there. And then you see another push from Tyler Reddick pushing the 14 to Chase Briscoe right back around Larson and the five back underneath of him. This is the racing that I came for right here. Kyle Larson just became the race's sixth different official leader at the start finish line. Right now just in on points as he's under attack from the 43 of Jones trying to take that third spot away. And there can stay alongside right here. Again, we've seen this multiple times. Eric Jones on the bottom. Good momentum into the corner, though. Laney will try to roll on the outside. He does. He fights hard to be able to keep this spot. The side draft from the 43 is coming. Look how close they have to get. They have to be that aggressive to make it work. And like it has in previous years. So where does Hamley go? Who's he going to try to push? Oh, Hamley got really tight right there. Off turn three. And again. The win of the stage goes to Kyle Busch. A photo finish. Logano went bottom feeding and uh, came up to fifth. He's it's getting better. Four wide off the two. Look out.
Still don't have it sorted out. Back to three wide. And side by side for the lead. Oh, 12 really drove it off in the corner, washed up. Got it back underneath of him, and here comes a hard charge on the outside of Kurt Busch. Brother in tow. Behind them, they're three wide for sixth. <laughs> There's too much going on here to cover it all. Still three wide. It's amazing how much more side by side they can do this year, and the car on the inside not get loose. It actually looks like they almost get tight. Gain of track position, all that helped Kevin Harvick. Big run by the 22, he's going to the inside. A block from Bubba, three wide now down into turn one and two. Oh, the 22 up the racetrack into the five. The five gets loose. Larson has to lift. Bubba battling back on the outside. Logano. Here comes Blaney taking advantage of that. These two people. Good momentum in that high side for multiple rows back. Going down the back straightaway. Good push from the 20 car into the back of this 19. A true X. They still can't clear Stenhouse, though. Stenhouse fighting hard on the inside. Stenhouse, a little side draft. It's going to draw him even with Truex down the front straightaway. Almost nosing him out front, down into turn one. Got a half a car length lead for Stenhouse. Here comes that 19 car off the top, down the back straightaway. Joe Gibbs racing freight train up top as Martin Trex Jr. has a 20 of Christopher Bell behind him. Buries, oh, Stenhouse buries it down in the corner. He's going to push up. Have to lift off the gas a little. Importantly, stage points. Three wide here. Could be four wide. Oh, the one into the back of the 24. Moves him up the racetrack. Chastain moving to the inside, getting aggressive once again. Logano running in that third spot, but still for the lead. Larson surging ahead now. Once again, here comes the 11 as he fights. There's oh. contact made. Five, five, seven. Hamlin into the back five, of the five. five. The five still straight. This is how important a stage win is. You see Tyler Reddick coming off of pit road, but the pack is going to go by him as he tries to get off of pit road on those slicks. Here comes this pack of five cars. Oh, it's going to be the same thing again. Briscoe's going to be on his bumper in front of you, Bagman. Here they come now on the hill. Reddick is out front, but how for how long? Here's Chase Briscoe. He's trying to find his way through, almost pushing Reddick through. McDowell almost pushing Briscoe through. And then you've got Christopher Busher there as well. Here comes Briscoe taking a peek out of the pocket. They're throwing blocks. They dare not get offline. Oh, look at the eight. He misses the entry to the bus stop. Has to come to a complete stop here. Sir. He pushes in there pretty deep. He's going to miss the corner. Here comes the eight to the inside. A little bit of contact made. Can he get by him? They're approaching a left-hand corner right here. So the eight car on Reddick has side the side advantage. Side coming at you, now the nine's on the preferred the line, but the eight's going to take the spot. Oh, it's so bumper tight. Side. Still quarter. Clear, clear. Now the eight in the defensive position, and now he's going to try to outbreak him in the eight. Left quarter, he's there by himself. Great job by both Still drivers. There, to you. Bumper, clear, clear. Chase needs to keep the pressure on and not let that eight car of Reddick get comfortable out front. What a move by Reddick. Pursuit. On that outside line with Chase Elliott on the inside. Look at him fan out as they go into one. Way up the racetrack, the leader, Kyle Busch, the 18. Losing several spots, three wide for the lead. Denny Hamlin, Chase Elliott, Kyle Larson. Remember, Denny Hamlin did that. Got way up the racetrack at the very start of the race. Three wide into the tunnel. How's this going to play out as Kyle Larson comes back down to the yellow? Battle right here at the bottom of the three. It's awesome. It is good, isn't it? <laughs> I have to imagine that Kyle's like, what is going on? He, went, <laughs> he ran down the 45 using the top. But right before he passed him, Ty Gibbs jumps to the top. Now Kyle's on the bottom trying to make the pass. Just cannot get it done.
And normally this would be a brother battle, the 45 oh. Kurt Busch behind the wheel normally, <laughs> but after his issues. The uh, temperature is rising in that 18 car, Rick. <laughs> it is rising. The 47 right behind him, I bet he's even smiling. Watch this. I think he's laughing, kind of like, man, this is fun to watch these two right here side by side. So much has been said about Kyle Busch and hasn't re-signed yet with Joe Gibbs Racing. And of course, the promise that Ty Gibbs has shown not only in the Xfinity Series, but the few Cup Series races that he's been able to run. And now he clears the 18.